The Beginner's Guide to Using Paradox Mods in City Skylines 2. Let's get started. First, I'd like to put a disclaimer out there that the if you are using the Thunderstore.io mods, they are literally the same as the Paradox mods for City Skylines 2. Okay, welcome back to the City Skylines 2 menu. You're gonna see here on March 25th, you're gonna get a new option. It's called Paradox Mods. Now, right now, I am in the beta version because, well, it's not yet March 25th, but as soon as you click on that indicator, you're gonna notice that, okay, all of my mods were completely up to date and we can keep moving forward with the City Skylines 2 game. So, welcome to Paradox Mods in City Skylines 2. And as you can see here, we have a bunch of mods that, you know what, some of us on the Thunderstore.io were already using. Now, my initial feeling of just looking at this featured mod on the Paradox Mods, everything is amazing. I love how the icons are huge, so you're not, you know, you're not squinting your eyes and you know exactly what you're gonna click on mods wise. So what's cool is you can see, all right, here's the move it mod. You can see how large of a file it is, and then you can see the owner or well not owner, but creator of the mod itself. So let's say like Eldron, for example, for 529 tiles mod, you can see here, all right, Eldron, we know him from City Skylines 1. We know he creates great mods, we can trust it. Now I think my only issue with this is that they need a rating system, like maybe like give it like a five star, so five out of five star would be great. One star, you know what, maybe you shouldn't download this mod or the mod is broken and doesn't really work. So now that we have all of that, you know, taken care of. Like, I think this is still a great main menu for featured mods. I'm not mad about it at all. I think City Skylines 2 did an excellent job. Now let's go to the browse. Let's go to the top. You can go to browse and just like the previous mod system we had, you can scroll through and you can see exactly the mods that are available to download. And there's a ton of them. And on, honestly, we already have new maps and stuff like that. So this is a perfect, addition to City Skylines 2. Oh, we have a free range camera. That is the first I have noticed that. And on the right hand side, you're going to notice you can sort by most popular, most recent, last updated, and most subscribed. And also you can see, hey, maybe there's a city planner save game if we do click that filter. And there you go. I mean, the, I guess this is not city planner, but you can see here some people have test auto saves automatically in there. Next, what's really cool is playsets. This is new to City Skylines 2. The initial playset is the best mods to download just by starting the game. Like, let's say you were new to City Skylines 2 and hadn't really played the game. This was a perfect set of mods to use to improve your gameplay. And you can have a playset for possibly each of your different maps. Like let's say you have two different cities going on and you want two different sets of mods, you can easily move between both. Now what's really nice is let's say you disliked a mod and you want it off the list, you can click on that red trash can and it will delete the mod from the playlist itself. If you want to deactivate the mod, you can see here it's enabled. If you click on that, it does take a few seconds. Watch, I just clicked it and it might take a couple seconds, but yes, eventually the mod does turn gray and disabled if you don't want to use it. Obviously, we want move it enabled and then you go over to the library and you can see every single mod you have downloaded for City Skylines 2 and obviously you have the same filters as the browse. So guys, what do you think of City Skylines 2 Paradox Mods? Are you excited for this game? Do you think this will save City Skylines 2? Um, overall, I am very, very happy with the mods and how this all played out. Very excited for March 25th. Please leave a like and comment if you love City Skylines 2. Have a great rest of your day.